Bobby's or Orange, episode five. When we last left our hero, he beat up the police force and had his first dream of a girl or something. What will he do next? You probably have a rough idea. Find out anyway. Today on... Bobbies are boring. Bobbies are boring indeed. We joined yesterday walking over to the once roadblocked section of Onet. So, you're the kid in the red and blue cap that Captain Strong was talking about? Yes. We have orders to let you through. All right, awesome! Wow, I've never been here before. The grass is so much... not greener. Hmm. Hey, look, a bike store! Hey, bro! Welcome to Punk Shore Cycle Shop! You should totally get a bicycle, because they're rad, and it's, you know, faster than walking, unless you really suck at cycling. Would you like to buy a bicycle? Sure, that sounds pretty good. Yeah, uh, uh, I, I lied. Uh, we don't have any to sell at the moment. But, dude, we do have some rentals. Would you like a rental bike? Sure, that sounds pretty good. A actually, I lied again, dude. We're, we're out of rentals, but we do have this one free demo version that we give to people with straightforward attitudes, just like yours, bro. Would you like to have it? Sure, that sounds pretty good. All right, here you go. Just put it in your backpack. Don't forget that you can't ride more than one person at a time on your bike because it's really freaking dangerous, dude. Also, you can't ride while holding teddy bears because it's illegal in Eagle Land. Sure, that sounds pretty good. Have a good day. I'm gonna ride my bike. I feel the breeze in my hair! Wait, what's that? Dude! I need that bike to stop the war! No man, that's my bike! Well now it's my bike! Don't do that! Too late! Dude, my bike got stolen! Hey, look, a park! Wow, look at all the cool stuff! Hey, what's a guy doing up there on the roof? <laughs> you want to talk? Let's chat later, after we've locked horns. Who are you? What's wrong with you? Why were you on the roof? And knock you upside the head, boy! <laughs> Looks like you beat me. Ah, come on inside for a second. <laughs> Yeah, I jumped off that roof. I think I twisted my ankle. Bummer. Anyways, uh, you're looking for Paula, I can tell. I, I can't explain it now, but you must promise me you'll bring her back to me, okay? Uh, are you some kind of pervert? No. No. No, no look, look, you don't understand now, okay? But you will. But come back with the girl. Hello. Okay, Mr. Bye! Well, I should probably go get Paula. From what I've read about her on her MySpace, her parents have a preschool around here. Oh, there it is! Hello there! 
If you're looking for Paula, please try not to worry too much about it. She has a guardian angel, it seems. Wait, where is Paula? We're not really sure. She was kidnapped last Thursday. Oh, crap! You're welcome to go to her room if you like. Hey, who are you? My name is Ness. I've come looking for Paula. So you're Ness. You're the one in Paula's dreams. Yeah, I'll go get her right away. Wait, is, is she here? Uh, she should be. I'll get her. That, 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 that's really odd. She doesn't seem to be here at the moment. Per perhaps stop by later. Well, your wife just told me that she was kidnapped last week. Uh, what? Are you serious? Man, we, ne we never talk anymore. She's always in that other room, and I just never put forth the effort to just walk in there. Anyway, Ness, it's vitally important that you get my daughter back to me, you understand? Ness? Ness? Oh, oh, oh sorry, sorry. I, I seem to have nodded off there a minute. Yeah, anyway, I, I, I got it. Paula's in the mineshaft, and I need to get Lassie. Whoa! People made of fruit? That's awesome! I'm going to check out this Apple Kid guy! Oh man! What's that smell? Uh, oh, oh! Sorry about that. Uh, uh, I haven't showered in a few days. Uh, I've been putting pieces of this crap on my floor together in hopes of creating a machine to solve world hunger! <laughs> Speaking of hunger, do you, do you have... Do, 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 do I smell some food on you? If you have some food, do you think you could share? Uh, I guess so, yeah. I, I have a hamburger, like, right Oh here. my god, good lord, give me that thing! Nom 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 really nom 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 Sorry, I, I, I didn't even introduce myself. Uh, I'm Apple Kid, one of the inventors in Tucson. Oh, okay. Uh, by the way, uh, I could really use 200 bucks. Do you think you could possibly, you know, swing that? Uh, man, I, I totally don't have any money, unfortunately. I can smell money, and you have some, and I need it. <laughs> man, I'm sorry, but... I just... I NEED IT! One, ah, one, fine, one, fine, need fine, it! Take it, take need it, take it, take it, take it! Uh, uh, sorry for spazzing out on you. I, I just needed that money. Who knows, maybe sometime soon I'll be helping you out with my inventions. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like next episode or something. What? So, Ness! Met a handful of people, including Apple Kid, who was actually not made of apples. You know, which is pretty ironic. What's even more ironic is that he didn't even have any apples or any food for that matter. Next week, he, Ness, will encounter exploding trees, a shroom-loving girl, and twelve dead corpses in a gutter. Well, one of those may be a lie. Find out which one is a lie next week on Fobbies Are Orange. Do. Do, 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 do. Outro Chris at Mango. Outro Chris at Mango. Do. Do, do, do. Okay, well. Yep. Yeah. And that was it. That, that was, was it, man. It. I think that was it. It twice. So, uh, guys, I. I've been I've been having this really hard problem in my head, and I I wanted to know if you guys happen to know the uh the answer to my question. Uh, go for it. Uh, how do you get the sub badge? What are you talking about? Uh, the the.